We're getting close to our 10 year mark and that's just crazy to me to figure, you know, that we've been doing this for almost, you know, 10 years. I feel like this is one of our most, uh, I guess, like the harder albums that we've ever written as far as, you know, difficulty and making sure that we're on time and everything. On Self-Titled, we just kind of showed up and tracked the songs and they were what they were. On Are In This War, we made it a point to actually analyze them a little more, put a little bit more effort into breaking down the songs and making them the best they possibly can be. Some of it was just piecing riffs together, working out the, the final touches. We, we all came together and put our heads in together more so than we ever had on any album. This band is like a democracy, like everybody has their own input. We kind of operate only under pressure, last minute kind of things. Sometimes we have to ride on the road when we don't have enough time to get what we need to get done at home. They always give us a time limit that's not really adequate anyway. Our Endless War, the title track from the record, came from demoing riffs in Europe. You know, being able to ride on the road is a really crucial element to be able to get uh, records done on time. Whenever we're on the road, we're just constantly thinking about us as a band and it makes it easier for us to come together and actually write together instead of uh, you know having an excuse while we're at home you're always all doing the same thing you're all you're here to perform music and your music is always going to be on your mind The recording of the record was actually pushed back by a couple of months. We honestly just weren't really satisfied with the material that we had. It being a very big release, we just didn't feel confident in where it was, and now that we took the time, we came together for a better product in the end. We're supposed to have a, a record you're supposed to be proud of. We didn't want to put out a, an inferior product. We just wanted to fine tune everything and make sure that we were putting out the best content that we could possibly put out. After the uh, previous record was done recording, we just kind of start from there. That's all the record is, just kind of experimenting and see what, what riffs kind of stick with you and what, what really like harmonizes with what you're trying to do. Stuff comes together you know, on their own and stuff gets brought there. The pre-production for this record didn't really differ that much from self-titled in that we all wrote riffs and ideas for songs at our own home studios and then we all got together and kind of put the CD together. I liked it a lot more because it felt like we were all together. I was uh, kind of really stumped, you know, just had like writer's block. We were just so burnt out from touring and we just wanted to spend time home and with our families and stuff. And I think that really brought out a lot of, uh, you know, emotions and uh, it really just kicked us into gear. It's like you almost have to have like bad stuff going on in your life or like you know just any any sort of emotion will help you write music because music is all based on emotion. 